Uh, Doofus Dingus. It's not Doofus Dingus until um, they start not playing their mains. <laughs> Would that happen? Do you think that would ever happen? I feel like at an Arcadian, weirdly enough, they're going to be taking it really seriously. Why? Uh, I believe there's a non-insignificant amount of money on the line, depending on the amount of entries. I think winner of this gets three hundred dollars. Oh, yeah, never mind. No, this is um. That's what is not the bad. Loser? That's what not is, bad at all. Yeah, no, that's that at least covers that size the, of the the, yeah. the 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 gas fees. Shoutouts to all one hundred twenty-five singles entrants. Thank you for everybody coming. What? I better goddamn see you at Xenosaga. Yeah, oh. that's gonna be in the first weekend of November. So oh yeah. Also, this. put exclamation point Maturino in the chat if you want yeah. to. Uh, yeah. Xenosaga number forty-four. You could also sub to the channel. We are one sub away. From we are. We're, so. we're so close to our goal, guys. One more sub. <laughs> we are one sub away from our goal. What With is your, your goal? help, we can reach it. It's a goal. That is the goal. It's a surprise goal. Oh, it's a surprise that's goal? Right, yeah, that's we get to know when we get one more okay, sub. Got it. <laughs> oh. oh, good weight, but also even better forward tilt from Helper. Like, you pressure the, th uh, you pressure the freeze. I <laughs> It doesn't hit when it does. It doesn't hit when it should, and it should hit when it and it hits when it doesn't. Yes. <laughs> Words. <laughs> Interesting that we're going to FD here. I'm surprised this wasn't banned because I feel like Sora extremely benefits us off, off of platforms. Well, I also feel like Sora extremely benefits when the opponent can't retreat to any platforms when they need to land. I mean, consider and this. Helper is off of the main platform. At all times. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. What are platforms to a man who's under the stage? <laughs> There's a John Numbers joke somewhere here. Yeah. <laughs> where, where can we find? Uh, I don't know. That's his friend. <laughs> I will say this is very <laughs> that one in. This is very similar to the first time these guys played, where Helper was just able to pressure Fighter Force Shield so well and effectively without ever being in like threatened of getting counterattacked. Just the range that Sora has and how many, you know, Rekka sort of mix-ups there are. Is... Player 4 just has to sit there and watch his shield be whittled down to nothing and just be like, okay, this is fine. Yeah, it just, it just feels like that Helper is never in any um, any significant what? amount of pain when it comes to, like, recovering from off stage. Is... Counter-attack is just so fluid as a means to counter against turnips, to counter against um, many of the... Um, any of the pressure that player four wants to put up, Sora has a way to work around, whether it be with spells, counter, or just the big hitbox that is Sonic Blade. Oh, yep. at 170? Yeah. Up tilt has pretty decent scaling, all things considered. Oh, yeah. I like the mix up on that combo there. Going for up air first to try and entice helper, uh, to try and entice player four to try and uh, mount a combat, uh, mount a falling aerial there I and get intercepted. I can't believe that Faraga landed. That was like the perfect time to do it, where it was just above getting hit by the turnip, but just close enough to the ground where it clipped player four's head. The just awareness that helper has right now is so good. Look at that, having to drift back, but. All right, actually, Player 4 getting all the way back to stage. I'm surprised about that. He had to run through the gauntlet. That was an odyssey. Boom. Boom. <laughs> it was still understandable from Helper to not want to sacrifice his own stock in doing so and instead decided, like, I'm just going to manually control this, and if I hit you, great. You're, the lead is already so massive that you can just continuously play this how you normally would. Non in also including the mini game of ooh I'm under the stage oh you're gone that's two stocks he took off of the freeze pop out Blizzaga so like consider this right Thundaga has very particular uses and when it's good it's usually pretty good but despite its inconsistency of whether or not like your opponent falls out of it or not but Firaga and Blizzaga are amazing always, always and forever. You always want to see these spells and can always find a way to use them. If Sora didn't have Thundaga, he jumps a tier. Really? It is that particular that sometimes, and quite often, you can get stuck on Firaga in a lot of awkward matchups where you really just want uh, Fire and Blizzard to stuff out approaches or to get off of ledge, and Thunder, you just, it's kind of rotting in your menu. Yo, give him stop. Give him what? Give him stop. 
Stop going. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was wrong. <laughs> Are you saying that would be a problem? Are you I, saying there's precedent I, of a character being given a time freeze and having it? Okay. Um, I, anyway, I, Helper doing what he was doing in the game one pretty much the same way. 63% and he's already taken the first stock of player four. Fire, thunder, freeze. Fire. Like, you can rotate through spe In a matchup where uh, floaty on floaty or uh, slower characters overall are the reason why Sora, one of the many reasons why Sora is really good against heavies and slower characters is that you can almost rotate spells for free. And that's why you, uh, that's why Thunder doesn't seem as bad uh, as it can be when you play against Sora's more like awkward matchups. But because player four just is partially not able to and partially not uh, pushing the envelope against Helper Sora, like, the spells are going to come out all day, every day, and Player 4 just has to live with that. Freeze. Oh, oh my god. I, you know, I will say that I was going to say, well, one of the saving graces for Thundaga is its ability to edge guard off stage. Of course. But, I mean, we just saw it right there. Yeah, I mean, the, the inconsistencies that it has is... Uh, one of the many, one of the couple reasons why it, it just doesn't work as well as, doesn't work with Sora's kit, at least how it's deve been developed thus far, as well as uh, Blizzard or Fire. And wow, that side dash takes it. That's three stocks to one. This is a really bad position if you're player four. <laughs> and it feels like there's just a game plan that Helper has that has not been contested. It just continues to excel and bring him wins. I was gonna say, like, we did have a moment of Rage Sora, which Rage Sora is actually kind of nuts. Um, this is now we're just back to normal Sora, though, but it still is equally strong against Peach in a lot of these ways because it feels like Peach can't float. And yeah. you're taking away the biggest X factor and the one of the best secondary mechanics in Smash Bros. Period. Yeah, I mean. Sora has become much more of, correct me if I'm wrong, he's like more of a bait and punish type character now. You know, because he has that like, dead? Not quite yet. But, now you're, now you're dead. Yeah, but because he's become, he's like at that awkward range of, he like can't really quite use his sword stuff like he wants to because like the tippers don't really yield him that much. So, like, yes and no in a lot of ways where. Like, take this instance, for instance. Or in, in this instance, for instance. This moment, for instance. Th take this moment for moment. Actually, let's reset this. Take here. He lands his back air, and now he has a chance. Nice back air. Nice. Now he has a chance to actually play through this. What Helper wants right here is to land an up air or an up B. Those are your big finishers off stage. Uh, up B, uh, or he's facing backwards. So it's kind of back air or up B, something like that. So what you need to then do is bait out the air dodge first and foremost. So you can play it very bait and punishy, but he's more he's more akin to a heavy frame trap kind of character because he is so floaty and can occupy the same space by both mixing in fast falls and stopping his fast falls with spells. So he approaches this with a double jump in order to try and consume that space and trap uh, trap player four into a, a position where there is no winning option. That can either be here, but can he extend in this particular interaction, but he can extend that frame trap instead because he's so floaty further and further into the stage. Mm. So I wouldn't necessarily, well, while you can obviously do plenty of baiting and punishing thanks to his uh, really solid aerial drift and the nature of Sonic Blade, what he is more adept at, at least right now, is frame trapping. And you can frame trap floaties with juggle game, or you frame trap uh, fast followers with your prolific combo game. So let this play out. Like he positioned the back air, forced to go low. You're trapped in this position. Blizzard to cover ledge get up and. Wow, it still hit. Neat. Oh, yeah. It wasn't true, but he floated into it. Again, trapped. Especially yeah. with Blizzard. Blizzard literally trapped. <laughs> trapped in the ice. What killed the dinosaurs? The ISA. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I thought of. Stay cool, bird boy. <laughs> 
That's my favorite line. <laughs> I don't have enough context of somebody that I can call Bird Boy to use it. <laughs> like, listen, anytime Sora is playing against Falco and he gets frozen, I will say it every time. But there are so many instances where you can quote Arnold Schwarzenegger saying Bird Boy. <laughs> Uh, I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> <laughs> Is this mid-game coaching? With it might be. That's fine. Yeah, Arcadian. <laughs> it's encouraged. Be the best that you can be. Why is Helper not doing it then? Helper <laughs> helps himself. That's why he's Helper. Yeah. yeah. Really? Why? Why? Helper is doing his own mid-set coaching. You can't see it because of the mask. He's just talking to himself <laughs> constantly. Hold on, hold on. How can you get more help? When you're already the help, okay, we can really. I bet, I bet MTW right. told them to taunt right there. I bet that's what the coaching was. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a very MTW move. <laughs> Freeze! Are you gonna die again? Oh, wow, no, he didn't yeah. die out of Blizzard this time. Delayed the delayed the mash. Like it is still defense. There is still like defensive counterplay, very similar to like fairies. It's just you know it's, it is kind of annoying because Sora has you get popped up. Unless you're buffing an air dodge, which is scary, you get popped up in such a perfect position for Sora to follow up. Saturn. Hey, wow, how many? Five? Five, right? I think it's five, yeah. Oh, okay, that was actually really good. He shielded enough to bait it out and then rolled. Oh, honk. <laughs> I, don't no. even, I don't even think it's coaching. I think, honestly, P4 just wanted uh, his own personal hype man. Yeah, no, that's, I, I'm just, literally, it's what I was talking about before. He's whispering in his ear, you're doing great. It's like, kid. bro, bro. Yeah, <laughs> you're doing. Yeah, look at you. Like, let's let's do this. Can we can we get someone to read his lips and transcribe what he's saying? Yeah. Oh, this <laughs> is. He's like he's like giving him the nice fingers every time he's like hitting him. Dang. I mean, granted, ever since getting oh. uh, getting MGW in his literal corner, uh, this is the best position that. Oh yeah, this is, he's doing great right oh, now. Oh yeah. Now. Uh, Wait, is this legal during the weeklies to have somebody who's not no, coaching you? Purely an Arcadian thing. <laughs> no, no, but like if oh my oh, god, he got sent up <laughs> twice. <laughs> Yo, what was that? that? I remember when Sora was first announced. That was the fear that everybody had. Uh, <laughs> there is it. It's realized. Yeah, it's so inconsistent being sent that way. But I guess the, the DI that Player Four was going for in combination, he was the angle he was hit at made him get Sonic Blade up and to the right twice over, and he homed straight in and, sl and slammed him for it. This is a very least a forward throw. Yeah, prepping the Thunder below stage. Goes back in the same, in the same direction. Okay, I like the fact that help, uh, player four now is staying outside of Blizzard range, when, at least when he's uh, close to the ledge. But, um, oh, oh, that was, that was really well, good. Yes. I love that. He went just like threaded through those lightning bolts. He knew that there was going to, only going to be so much time in between those spells where he could actually find a kill, and he braved the storm and found it. Can he close out this game? Can he find a way to close out this game? Floating straight through the thunder. And oh, almost getting a double turn up combo there. 71% Sora. Not, I mean, not to say anything, but Sora has been, despite the defensive gameplay, Sora is rather light. But throwing around a big forward smash, pulling a winky face as well. Player four in a chance to close out this game number three. That fair would have been a pretty cemented finisher. But instead, just prepping and it's more and more of these backers, keeping the corner alive. Live to see this pressure another day. Oh, oh, helper is being so much more patient in the corner, but it almost, I feel oh. like it's fear. That fire, the counter ended up screwing him oh, over. We've seen him die to this so many times. That's not right. going to be killing, but 129 versus 100 and 125. Still not dying from that, and he will be making it back with why do you have mean? the jump? But he had all this other seven million resources. Yeah, I don't know about that one, Chief. I don't know why he didn't use them. I mean, mm. I, didn't I think guess he, he had was his jump. He, I mean, what happened here? What? <laughs> just, <laughs> just did it. He's like, like, you know what? He just did it. Okay. See me in game four. <laughs> uh, you want me to go back? To yeah, it? I, I really right. want to know where this jump went. Like, I don't... Wait, wait. Go, yeah, go back like 10 frames here. Did he, like, jump, then instantly double jump? 
Like okay, IDJs like, are a thing, right? I, yeah, there, there it, is. it is. Oh yeah. wow! What? He went for IDJ up air here. Why? Uh, the hardest read of his life. He was expecting Peach to, uh, magically teleport to okay. the top of. Okay, so IDJ up air hits lower than normal up air. It it would hit about here when I uh, normal up air hits like here. I don't. I, maybe they're a little bit lower, but that still hits either way. It hits a standing Peach. If you're calling out a jump, normal up air works just fine. I genuinely think that was a misinput. The fact that he seemed so unconscious of it. That is. Uh, is the MGW power up what he needed? The tea bag? Yeah, that's that's some real MGW <laughs> right there. Tactical crouching, excuse me. Oh, going. Uh, didn't. I love how MGW is also just like he's Mario Kart DIing every single hit. You know what I mean? Someone has to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually I'm just watching MTW's reactions now and wondering if I could figure out what's happening on the screen just based on his head nods. <laughs> MTW is a demon coach and he's telling Reggie how handsome he is. <laughs> <laughs> Take his dog, take it. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, that's a come to Zeno Saga. <laughs> <laughs> Can we implement this at Xeno Saga exclusively player four? I'm sorry, not play like MGW. Like if you pay MGW five dollars, MGW just... will sit next to you and tell you how handsome you are. <laughs> I, and like, head I like that idea. Yeah. Yeah. He I like can that whisper, and he'll in a wave away, and he kills that might happen to you. He'll be like, nah. Twenty-nine damage, by the way. <laughs> oh, I'm a one move there. I saw it too. Thunder. Thunder. Yeah. Oh, going for the up air into freeze instead of just going into Sonic blades. Very nice. Yeah. 84. Ooh, that was a good grab. That was a turn one grab, too, I think. Yeah, gotta find a way through these stalemates somehow. <laughs> Sorry, the voice lines are killing me. <laughs> oh. yeah, retreating and under the. or dashing wow. under the platform there was so huge. And, oh, oh, yep, 27. Oh, the. The absolute transformation of when Helper gets access to a stage as wide as this, something as flexible as a Hollow Bastion, where you have that center platform, but the stage is wide, the blast zones are huge as well. Very clean stuff on the part of uh, Player 4, though, bouncing off. I mean, if there's one time in your life to get a comeback, it's when A, a lot of money is on the line, B, you have the honor of your friend who spent all of his... Uh, he spent his evening coming out to support you, next to you, yeah. breathing in your ear. Would you want to let MGW down by giving up just because you're down by a little bit? You can't let him down when he's mere inches away from you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Whispering those sweet nothings. Oh, it's okay, going in too. This is Someone's gonna. Yeah. That's actually really good. Oh, and getting the tech face on the platform. That move is very rarely see stores use it, but. Down air? Yeah, down air yeah. sucks. Uh -oh. Okay. Why does it look like Thundog is always going to kill and then it just doesn't when it's supposed to? Thunder. Oh, Thunder dead. tries. No, not quite yet. The, the match outs has been really good from player four yeah. after that game one. He's been much better about not matching out with just like a buffered yeah. option that gets him killed. And just being very reserved when it comes to his timings and changing them up pretty well. Just, that's just it. No shorter just Oh, okay. So you have to find your way to the other side of the stage. Jump fire. There it is. Just keeping away from Stitch at all costs. That was oh, a and super oof. bad roll. Able to get massively punished for it. Stitch face online is scary, but the roll through gets him by. And the thing is, he had to hold shield for just a hair longer to make sure that there wasn't going to be that third hit. And... There it is, just making sure that he clutches it out. Helper winning the entire bra What was that? That was that was no mix-up I've ever seen in my life. Okay, okay. That, it's just, it's just like twinkle toes. Yeah, it's, <laughs> listen, you're playing rock, paper, Magic scissors. Hand. He's playing chopsticks. Or Yeah, I'm, I'm so bad at this game, by the way. Wait, what? <laughs> 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 uh, I want to. Okay, this was actually super clean. The run under the platform there to try and uh, to yeah. set that's up. That's the forward air, right? Yeah. So Pe Peach comes down with forward air. You get a nair set up there, and oh, it was the nair that he outspaced. Like, I'll go back. Boom. Play this in. Yeah, the real back motion. 
Okay, we're, we're reeling back more than that. Like, in this position, like, you're... You set up a scramble over here, and Peach can come down to you. Or like, float there, float there, like, fast fall in there. Like, there's so much danger that can be here. So Helper just immediately finds a safer spot. But since Player 4 still wants to be aggressive, he's down a whole stock at this point. It's like, all right, like, he takes the gambit and faces a disjoint to the face. Like, also, I love how the reason, one of the other reasons why he went for that forward smash is it... Kind of, if you could see. So, we'll let it play out in slow. Okay, a little bit faster motion than this, maybe. Okay, so, you notice this here? He had, like, the Captain Falcon leg. You know what I mean? Like, his leg was sticking so far oh, okay. out behind him that if he didn't go for a move that shifted his hurt box, he would have gotten hit by that neutral air. Like, Look, the neutral that comes down, it would have been right here where this toe is. He would have gotten his toe stubbed right off. <laughs> uh, but instead... There's the coffee table, there guys. There, 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 there is. And then, look the at that. Table. Because he goes for the forward smash. Look how quickly this leg goes away. Boop, boop, boop. We... And he, he, does the, he does the... He does the little slide. He does a little... Shoop. Yeah. All right, super nice. And then, <sighs> and then we just get to... As much as we get to see like player, uh, player four take take out this stock, I think this final clip, the final stock over here. Oh, you want the, I'll, I'll the, final the final stock? One. I'll give you the last one. Thanks, bro. It, it landing this nair exemplifies everything that is so good with Sora in an advantageous position, because you land nair two, up air covers all of this. Player four has to respond, but fair covers all of this. So what do you respond with? Primarily air dodge? Read your air dodge with something like a down tilt here, which also sets up into up tilt, uh, which also sets up into up tilt or uh, in this percent up air. So can you really afford to get popped up like this? Okay, so maybe you air dodge directly down here, but a directional air dodge, that's super risky. But up air is so good that you can layer your up airs. I mean, just look at the amount of lines I'm drawing on the screen. The amount of coverage that Sora can apply upon landing just a neutral air two is absolutely absurd. And it layers into just this frame trapping madness as long as you can react accordingly to close out stocks without a care in the world. All right, there's one more thing I need you to break down, though. Sure. Oh, well, well, I know exactly what you're going to yeah, ask me to break down. Yeah. 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 All right, let's get well, to well, it. Let's, let, there we go. The most important play the yeah. entire night. All right, here, here's Watch the real play. All right, all right, all right, all right. right, all right. right, right. I can do <laughs> this right here. So here's the thing, the mix-up. So he positions himself. The, the Here it is, the fist. He is going to present the rock, right? <laughs> He presents the rock and look at this. Look, the, look at the reaction. The yeah, this flash. was not. This was not reaction. This was pure anticipation here. I'm gonna advance frame by frame. Look at that. The fingers meet. <laughs> the hand of God and Adam touch in the middle. <laughs> and what do they do? Here's the thing. It's a handshake, but they. <laughs> No, no, I'm, I'm sorry. Love is not, that is not love. What are these fingers doing? Fingers do not go at this angle. This was never what God intended hands to do. And <laughs> An anti heart. Anti heart there. <laughs> and then he grabs the finger. Look at that. Like, like, a, ba like a newborn baby grabbing his mother. <laughs> the hands. He tries the to pull away <laughs> and then he can't follow through. Look at his follow through. Look at his hand. He tries to get away. Playing for desperately pulling himself out of that situation like an octopus. Like a squid with its tentacles. Grabs him. There is doing? no escape. <laughs> it keeps going. You reach out for it again. It's, so, it's, it's instant. Look at this. The amount of force that has to be applied there. Oh, and a llama in the middle of it. Wait, hold on. This is this is the 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 Sistine Chapel right here. That's that's uh that's God reaching. <laughs> <laughs> can we get this? Uh, can we get a mural of this? Can this be posted? Oh my god! <laughs> oh. Can we get this plastered on the top of Zeno? This should be the background of the of the wall instead we, of no, a white wall. No, we put wall. this on the ceiling, bro. Oh yes, <laughs> yes, yeah. of course, of course. It's a chapel. <laughs> oh.
And, and man, then I look at this, the evasion. I love this right and, here. And man, the adaptation mid play. It Wish, wishing for his <laughs> wisdom, <laughs> which he does not provide. He <laughs> went for the follow through. Oh, it's a gorgeous story. And he <laughs> wipes his hand. Why? No, I have He's a question. Gone. Here. Why does Be the gone. finger? Why does he wiggle the fingers on his way back? Those why toodles. he does not need to wiggle. <laughs> and then they, and then they kind of wiggity wiggity. All right, yeah, no, it's. Look at, I love this. The story, the narrative. It's like the rising conflict into conflict. <laughs> <laughs> you have the lowest moment this of is the, the story, this is which the is right here. Wait, wait, where is it? The lowest moment, you know, like at the end of the second act, is like this right here. Yeah. Look at this. It's Look like at the, this. So fall, sad. And they fall apart uh, <laughs> here, right? Yeah, yeah. It's so sad. The break, the, like tears in your eyes, like, you know, you get like a like semicolon. <laughs> Don't Bro. <laughs> oh, okay. I don't know where the hell we were going. Semicolon. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. And then, um, look at this. Then we have the beautiful resolution. You know you can just let it play, right? No, I, oh, okay. I can't. Mm. There okay. it is. And, they and, come and, and a wonderful And a wonderful denouement. It's like uh, this, it's the tale yeah. of Job, where at the end, Job still has faith in his, in his God, despite the scorn that he has provided. Who's Job there? Uh -huh. Which one's Job? Helper's Job. And Helper's Job? Yeah, Helper's Job. And That's so sad. <laughs> <laughs> the man won a tournament and he's still Job. <laughs> Don't read the book of Job. <laughs> <laughs> it's, I, not getting into it. Hold on a second. I was about to have a biblical debate. I'm and I'm like, I'm oh, I know that. what to do here. Stop. Okay, so... <laughs> I think I think we have reached that point of night. We haven't reached midnight yet, but we've reached that point of night. <laughs> we reached the point of the night where the the, the 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 religious dialogue has to happen off stream. So I, I, I'll shake on that. I'll shake on that. All right. All right. <laughs> With that, I God think God is dead. Oh. <laughs> 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 On that note, thank you all so much for tuning in. I'll it was a that, blast brother. commentating for all of you. It was a blast getting to commentate with my lovely co-commentator. <laughs> you will uh, follow this man on Twitter at you will soul. And follow um, Salty Fun over there at, at Salty Fun underscore SSB. Sb as we, I think, are signing off for yeah, the no, end is, of the night. It has been all types of real. We will catch you again every Wednesday at Zeno. And course. for the monthly first week in November. Please, guys, come out, do exclam exclamation point Matt Gerino in the chat. Yep. Just show the love as much as you can. The scene absolutely deserves I it. I think you can register for Xenosaga right now, in fact. It is open for registry yes. at start.gg slash Xenosaga. Register cool. right this moment. Cool. And be sure to drop a, a follow for all of House of 3000's uh, socials, that being House of 3000 on Twitch, Twitter, and on YouTube. The VODs for this tournament are already up on the YouTube. You can check out the Twitter for uh, instant updates as well as the link to said VODs. And you can be sure to follow the strongest subsect of Tri-State every time they go live every single Wednesday and other days as well for things like Mixmasters and other events on the weekends at House of 3000. And if you sub right now, we will be one away from the goal. We will reach our goal. We will, reach our goal. We will even yes. reach, we will our reach our goal. Subscribe right now. Subscribe Please, right now. You. And be sh because you won't want to miss what's ha coming later in October, the Defend the North event. The massive... The North is under attack. <laughs> we have to we defend it. We must have to defend it. <laughs> we must defend it. <laughs> it's, it's under attack at least against some an invader from Delaware because MPG is already signed up for it as well as other New York heroes like Tilde, Jen, uh, Suarez, and more. Uh, it's going to have a ton of games there, a ton of various fighting games. Hey. Most of them are on PC. All of them are on PC except for Smash Ultimate and anything that's on a cabinet. <gasps> we just got the sub. We Thank did it. You we reached our goal. to Geek Boy for one, two, three, four, five gifted subs. Woo! That now puts us in a wonderful position of one away <laughs> from our goal. <laughs> Thank, Thank you for supporting your local. Yeah. Thank you all for supporting this stream time and time again. Thank you all for watching whatever it was that tonight was. <laughs> it was a blast. Tonight it was, was a blast. It was a good time. That's for sure. Yeah. 
uh, signing off. It has been Uvul, Salty, and the House of 3000. Have a good night.